Mr. Bunnell, Hearts Academy Technology Coordinator. Uh, this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to log into Schoology and change a few of the settings to your liking. Uh, so right here I have a browser window. It's already open. Uh, I notice a lot of students and some teachers will log into Schoology by clicking on the browser and I search for LAUSD, LAUSD Schoology and it comes up and then there's a place to click on and, and that takes too long. So what I like to do is just type in the address bar lms.lausd.net. Just go navigate directly to Schoology and you notice that the actual browser is like all these different characters but lms.lausd.net will take you straight there. If you're a parent, you click on parent. If you're a student, you click on student. If you're a second grade or under and you have a QR code, you show the camera and log in that way. And I'm an employee, so I click on employees and I go and I put in my email address and password and I'm in. Okay, this is the landing page, the home page for Schoology. When you log in uh, or if you click on L Los Angeles Unified right here, it will take you to your home page. Um, it, the other possibility is it might take you to this page. There are two basic home pages, the recent activity page or the course dashboard. The recent activity page is a page that has a bunch of messages. If you belong to groups, uh, you, like I belong to, L I'm an LMS champion, it shows there. If you, um, if you are, are friends with someone and they, they message there, if you are, you can, uh, send out a message to your whole school, um, lots of messages. You know, if you're a teacher and you post a lesson, it might have an announcement here. Um, so the, this is the message about recent activity. You can log in here. When you when you log in, it can be like this. Uh, you can tell your students or show them this video. If you want to change this, if you, let's say you want to have course dashboard and you don't, or you don't have course dashboard and you do want to have it, then you just click on your name, go down to settings, Scroll all the way to the bottom, click on whatever you want, Reason Activity or Course Dashboard, and save changes. And then when you save the changes, it will show right here. When you click, you'll log in and it'll be the Course Dashboard. Second tip, let's say I wanna have my third period class over here instead of over here. All you have to do in the Course Dashboard is just click and drag. And then you can move all the courses adjust to wherever they want to go. And you just click that and you can organize your classes. If I, I personally like to have my classes period one through six, upper left or lower right. So I'll organize it that way. And, and that's it. Just uh, sign in with lms.lausd.net. That takes you right to the page. No need to search. No need for extra steps. Once you arrive, home page, it, it's either going to be the course dashboard or recent activity. If you want one and don't have it, you want the other, then just click on your name, go down to settings, set it, save the changes and you're good. So that's it for now and scene.